Akpabio's girlfriend supplies diesel to NDDC. So they don't want light restored. X MD of NDDC exclaimed. The suspended interim managing director of the Niger Delta Development Commission, Joy Nuni, has said the reason the headquarters of the intervention agency remains unconnected to public power supply is allegedly because girlfriends of the minister for the Niger Delta, Goswil Akbabio, supplies the diesel for powering the generating sets. The former MD leveled the allegation on a morning program on Arise TV anchored by Dr. Ruben Abati. Nuni, who had last week accused Akbabio of sundry financial infractions, said Akbabio's girlfriend supplies diesel at the NDDC. I looked at the diesel situation and said, why don't we give the young Niger Delta boys the supply? Why can't we divide it into nine states for them to supply? NDDC is a past paid for us to get light directly. It was connected straight to the NDC headquarters building that was disconnected at the gates of NDDC. Millions was paid to get that light source to NDDC. To connect it from the gates, it was sabotaged just for it to go inside the building. I mean, look at the fraud in this country. When I came, I saw all these monies on diesel. I am not here to spend money. I am here to cut down. How do I tell Mr. President that I came to do forensic audits and I came in here to commit the same offense? I will not do it. We looked at the system, how much it will cost to connect the light. To cut the long story short, I approved. We got the engineers to repair that thing, but because I am not the one to pay, do you know that they refused to pay the money for us to connect that light into the office so that we can keep buying that diesels? Nuni had last week accused Akbabio of sundry financial infractions after appearing before the Senate's ad hoc committee investigating the NDDC. Akbabio and Nuni had appeared before the committee investigating the alleged mismanagement of 40 billion by the IMC of the NDDC. She told newsmen, nobody makes any payment in NDDC without gospel Akbabio. When we first came to the NDDC on the day of going for the inauguration, he told me in the car that Madam MD, if you don't do what I say, the same pen which I used to sign your letter, it will be the same pen I will use to remove you. He said the first thing I should do when I get to Portacourt is to change the dollars in the NDDC account. I was scared to do that. After that, he came to Portacourt two days after the inauguration. He said the first thing I should do is to make sure I change the dollars. I should remove Mr. Keltigo from being legal and send him on compulsory retirement. That we cannot have a Nottana being the head of the legal team of the legal unit. He said I should remove all the other directors that refuse to take his instructions during the time of Mrs. Akwagaga. That is the predecessor before I came. So he came also with a draft letter that I should write and put it on my letterhead, implicating Senator Mwaboshi of collecting contracts in NDDC. I told him that I will not, that I am a lawyer and that whoever alleges must prove that that fact that that Senator Mwaboshi is giving 
us trouble. Akbabio never signed any document. He will always refuse to sign, but will tell you to go and commit the fraud. For instance, he told me to go and raise a memo and give an emergency contract for flood victims. He wanted me to take an oath. He has denied that, but I want to say today, he told me up to three times until we had a reconciliation meeting at the villa in the house of Mr. Sareki Abba, who is the SA to the president on domestics. I refused to take the oath, so he said he was going to remove me. He started the campaign of calumny against me. I did not answer him because the facts will speak for itself. Then Mr. Linus, who was the director of, fin director of finance, refused to sign because he did not follow due process. Then he also said that I should implicate the chairman of the House Committee because the chairman had gone to Ondo State for a meeting to plan against him. Now, to end this matter about the procurement process, I refuse to go with him to deceive Mr. President at the FEC, Federal Executive Council, meeting because the Procurement Act says if I contravene any session of the Act, it is five years imprisonment without an option of fine. Akpabio went to get the approval from FEC. The 2020 budget has not even been discussed by the National Assembly till today. He lied to fake, which is the greatest embarrassment for a country. I refused. I am challenging him to deny any of this allegation. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. Thank you so much, Madam Joy Nuni, for this um, comprehensive reports concerning Gospel of Babio. See, if, um, if there is any agency that is so much corrupt, if there is any government agency or government organization that has a very high level of corruption, I tell you that it cannot be compared to NDDC. It can't be compared to NDDC. Because in NDDC, we have a lot of corrupt personnel. A lot of corrupt personnel. Of which... Akbabio, who stands as the chief executive officer of, of, of the NDDC, is, a, is, is the kingpin, is a master corrupt person in that, in that organization. Can you imagine? See what is coming out of the mouth of the XMD of NDDC consigning Godswill of Abio. You can imagine. See how the Nigerian funds have been have, have been messed up by the minister of Niger Delta. Eh? I'm totally disappointed in Godswill of Abio. Totally disappointed in him the, the people the people placed so much trust in him and so much confidence in believing that he's, he's going there he's going to there to, to give them a better representation unknown to the masses that is going there for his own selfish interest can you imagine giving this huge contract to a girlfriend a girlfriend not even his wife You see, that is the problem of some, 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 some of these, our, our, our ministers and politicians. 
My viewers, you really need to contribute to this issue. Please, your comments concerning these are very much important. Don't forget to leave them behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.